Well, this thing fixed. You'll probably see a video of it eventually, but it also had rusty grates. And as you see, it's full again because that one's a fat bastard over there. But you see, that used to be kind of long, but I just kept on cutting it down as it was rusting. I said, let me do something better. So they actually do make a special coating you can put on your grates when they start rusting. But what did I do? I just put some JB weld on there. I'm figuring that this is some sort of epoxy. So I just cut it, cut it back again, got rid of most of the rust, and then just put a blob of JB weld. And tomorrow, when it hardens more, I'll probably just shape it. I did it over there, over there, and uh, more dirty dishes. There's a couple little spots over here and over there. There are a lot over there. You know, it was just really rusting. I don't know, it might work, might not. I was thinking that little bit of JV weld is a poison, but I don't think so. These things were coated with something, probably epoxy. I don't think it's a paint. It's probably like an epoxy paint. Oh, dipped in steel and then it just dries it's probably similar same stuff but yeah JB weld it used to be come out to here but that's how much it rotted off but you know I can almost see stuff through here now but not really but it beats by a new uh, thanks because they were like a hundred dollars and a hundred dollars or more yeah so we fixed that I gotta do a uh, vinegar wash too the shitty water in here is horrible and uh, yeah we fixed it all up this thing is kind of breaking over here, which is awesome. Whirlpool garbage, and I put the bottom plate on. And it was all moldy when it got wet. I used this Clorox bleach spray on the insulation, and it looks brand new. You can't even tell. It's uh, stained and moldy. It's just, it bleached it all. It looks factory. Underneath there is the uh, some like white stuff. So I don't know. Hopefully it works for a year at least. Yeah, rusty grates, just um, try it, cut it off, I use a little bolt cutters, cut off the rust, and then I just seal the end with um, epoxy, I hope it's going to work, if it doesn't, I'll let you know, dirty, nasty, scale, I cleaned this seal too, and this seal is pretty stiff, that was a lot better, nice, dishwasher maintenance, nobody does it, and then if I'm brand new, pump piece over there yay we got the same stuff that uh, plastic dips made out of Performix yeah but uh I don't really see that that's probably just like an epoxy or a plastic paint they make two different colors I believe but I wouldn't I don't know I wouldn't buy it I don't know it's for white stuff it looks like a hack job Mine looks better. After, after I grind it, it'll be the same color. But yeah, common thing. Yeah, who would have ever known? Yeah. Oh my god, the people are showing this off. You ever see when people show stuff off in this world, and you look at it, and it looks like total shit? But they're like proud that they did it. Like, oh, look what I did, and this looks horrible. Like this. I always wonder about that. Like people think it's a good deal and it's not a good deal. That's not a good repair. My repair will be better after I file it down. I'll be the same color gray as the rest of it. Uh, I don't know. JB Weld, dishwasher safe. Time will tell. I don't know. Doesn't get that hot in there. We'll see. PVC. So it's probably like a plastic coating. Has a Proposition 65 warning, so you know. So does JB Weld. It gotta be good then. Mm-hmm. Yeah, interesting though, they make the coating for it. Prong rack caps. Oh my god, they make caps too. Really? That's pretty interesting. All stuff for dishwasher as well. Haha. <laughs> That's a pretty cool idea too. Interesting. You know the solutions out there when you look for them. Look like gray. Oh, I could have used these for $7.99. Wow, that's pretty cool. Who would have ever known? And I was thinking about buying racks for this thing. Nope, there's another solution right there, people. I'll link it in the description. 